So this is basically a review after six, seven months. To be honest, there's not much update. I didn't mess around with it. I didn't learn anything. I kept it bas basic. And I only used the app for it, their music. It has a Apple CarPlay. It looks even better than it does right now. The, this actual screen or the colors on this interface. But the only thing well, the only issue with it is it takes uh, a few seconds to respond. So if you put play, it takes three, maybe four seconds to play, which may not be an issue, but pausing it, skipping it, all that. So to me, it is an issue. It looks nicer, though, way nicer. The colors are much brighter. Um, and I will actually prefer this, but... I mean, I don't mess around with it. Hop on the car, turn it on, music plays, and, you know, I'm driving. Um, if I need a skip, it does it quick. So I prefer the actual app than Car, uh, car Play, Car Apple, Car Link. So, I mean, can't really give you an update besides it's still working, still plays the music, it still responds quickly. Um, so that's what I love about it. I uh, can't really do much. I mean, hey. So there, that's kind of my review. The only thing I can tell you about it, it has a front and reverse camera that I didn't mention last time, which I will be installing in a month or two. No more than that. Um, super easy, about a hundred dollars. You can do that with this, with this unit. Um, uh, I already took all the panels off. Just try to map everything out. It's going to be easy. Um, I might have broken a clip or two, but, you know, that's not an issue. Another thing I didn't mention, you can actually add a SIM card to this. And, um, you can play that, uh, you can use the head unit with the SIM card and actually play, watch video. You know, you can use your internet and, uh, use your YouTube uh, Pandora or any other app you want to download uh, what uh, Hulu Netflix and whatnot and you don't have to use your phone uh, that's a good feature I didn't mention that either but uh, equalizer still not using it or touching it so other than that I'm not really using it for anything never connected the OBD um, I have a scanner so there's no need for it I mean, it would be a nice feature, but eh, I don't want to do the work. I'm lazy. Most of us are, aren't we? So there we go. Hey, unit. After all this time, it's still working. Still looks good. Still happy for $100. I think I'll be having it for, what, another couple of years? And we'll be done with it. So, even on the other vehicles, uh, head units, stereos, you can't be this far away with the music playing because the Bluetooth cuts off. May not be a big deal for you guys, but for me it is.